Hello, it's me, your friendly neighborhood little tortilla. And uh, welcome back, I should say, to Super Castlevania 4. So, it is the middle of October, and I thought it would be appropriate to revisit uh, Super Castlevania, since I did it originally, like, four years ago. Um, and I, I had a lot of fun doing it. Um, so I thought again, you know, why not try to, once again, see how far I can get. Uh, in one sitting and make a series out of it um, and I will note it has been oh god a long time since I've played Super Castlevania so I'm gonna be a little rusty but and I'm gonna do uh, like I said originally or like when I originally made this I did it in I recorded it in one sitting and broke it up into multiple episodes so I'm gonna do that again because it's fun that way I will say one thing, like, I've been playing, you know, this, the uh, Final Fantasy VII Remake recently. If you haven't watched those videos, you know, I'd suggest watching them. They're a little long, but, uh, they make for great, like, just ambiance noise, honestly. Um, however, I do have to say, God, there's just something beautiful about 16-bit games, especially this one, like... The backgrounds are, like, this was released, what, 1994? I think it was 1994, but, like, look at that. Like, you can see mountains in the distance, and, like, they're actually dynamic. Like, they move, you know, the forest in the, the foreground kind of moves a little bit faster, and the mountains, well, actually, no, the mountains move a little bit faster. Um, but, like, it's just the fact that, like, they look so far away, you know, they're tiny sprites, but the fact that they're so far away, that really adds to the depth of how huge this area really is. Which is really cool, because, like, in a lot of 16-bit games I've played throughout my years of existence on this planet, you really don't see that much, like, depth in a 16-bit game. Now, I, could, I haven't played... There are beautiful 16-bit games out there that I just haven't played before. But! But! We're gonna make an exception. Wee! Or, uh, I'm just gonna go... Not an exception, but... This is probably the prettiest 16-bit game I've played. That or Fusion. Um... Which I don't... Uh, that is 16-bit. But it was on the Game Boy Advance, but, you know. S -s same... Same difference. God, it feels so good to be playing this again. I, I had the idea, too, of, uh, making this a, um, uh, like a yearly thing. <laughs> no, Dragon Tower, that's illegal. I'll whip you to death. And then after that, you know, I'm gonna move on because I'm a vampire hunter. But I'm gonna whip everything to death in here. Because it's fucking cool that way if I do it like that. Um... But I decided that I think I'm gonna do this, like, as a yearly thing. Um... I think it'd be fun to, like, every year try to, to sit down and be like, Okay, I'm gonna play Castlevania. At least, like, recording. Because obviously, you know, in my free time, it's my free time. But I think it'd be fun, like, every year to sit down and make a, uh... A series about playing Super Castlevania and trying to beat it in one sitting. I can get to stage 11, though. I have, I have improved since, uh... The last series I've done, which was two years ago. I already said that, but, you know. I just noticed the little, like, horse tail moves back there. You see it? I also, uh, have played the original Castlevania, and I just have to say, good god, am I glad that Medusa heads are so much easier to kill in this game. Like, god, they really are the banes of the existence in the original game. No lizard ghost. Plus, I do miss being able to sit there, no matter what comes to my own, just go... I do miss being able to do that. Which, I believe I've said this in the first video too, but, uh... This game is the first game that ever that actually lets you, like, with a whip, that changed how whip physics works in uh, video games. Like, for the fact that you can do this, and that you can whip in multiple... Ow! In multiple angles, not just... Ow! Excuse me, sir. I don't very much like the fact that you're kind of kicking my ass right now. If you could stop for a moment, that'd be great. Eh, 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 eh. 
But yeah, you, uh, um, this was like the first game to really like change whip combat forever in games. Which is just neat, I think. <laughs>